What's up everyone? My name is Austin Bunn and this is your sports update. Women's soccer got their first win of the season last Wednesday in double overtime against ODAC opponent Sweetbriar and then tied the league leaders of Shenandoah University 0-0 on Saturday. The men's soccer team fell 6-1 to to Virginia Wesleyan in the team's conference opening game. Wasp Volleyball traveled to Atlanta for the Emory Invitational over the weekend. Wasp fell four times, they took the court, but looked to rebound against Eastern Mennonite this week. Football picked up their third win of the season over Methodist, putting up 61 points on the Monarchs. These 61 points were the most put up by a Coach Montgomery team and the most since 1990. The entire Wasp offense was clicking on all cylinders as the team rushed for 243 yards and threw for 382 passing yards. Junior wideout Josh Smith hauled in 12 passes for 153 yards and two touchdowns. Wasps have this weekend off, but will be looking to prepare for the opening conference game on October 5th when they travel to Randolph-Macon. The senior signal caller for the Wasp, Kyle Bowden, was named ODAC Offensive Player of the Week on Sunday. Bowden threw for 382 yards and five touchdowns, completing 93.5% of his passes, giving him the single game completion record in the conference. The NFL is great for most fans. But for Redskins fans like myself and Giants fans like my girlfriend Lauren, there isn't a lot to cheer for. But look at the bright side. If both teams were playing golf, we would be undefeated. So to Mike Shanahan and Tom Coughlin, might be a good idea to go hit the link soon. Just a suggestion. That's going to do it for this sports update. Until next time, play hard out there.